today we are going to lecture how to configure dynamic routing in three route environment. We are using router 2811 so that we can connect more than two ports. To enable a router to connect more than two ports, first we click on the router, go to physical, power off the router, click on the NN4E and drag it to the router, power on again. Configure the other router. Repeat the same step as above. Drag the PC to each of the router. Connect them using copper close over wire. As you can see, this is network 1, network 2, network 3, network 4, network 5, and network 6. Now we are going to configure the IP address of the PC. Click on the PC, go to desktop, IP configuration. Okay, type the IP address of this PC. It's 200.1.4.1. Okay, the subnet mask is given, and then the default gateway is. 200.1.4.254 Do this for the other PC as well. Afterward, go to the router. Click on the router. Go to configure. Okay, as you can see, this is like FA0 slash 0. We go to this one. On the port status, type the IP address for this port. 200.1.6.254 and then go to the other one FA01 on the port status also type the IP address 200.1.5.253 the other one is Ethernet 1 slash 0 on the port status type the IP address Go to the RIP routing. Add the three networks that connect to this router. It is network 1, so we add 200.1.1.0. It is network 5, so we change to 5. 200.1.5.08. So we add the, the last one, network 6. Okay. Do this for the other two routes. Now we try to ping each other. If the status is filled, we can try a few more times also. Now the status becomes successful.